Hello class, this is section 1.4 and in this video I want to go through an example of a word problem that deals with the growth decay equation. So this problem uh, we have a culture of bacteria and we know that the number of bacteria increased sixfold in 10 hours and we need to find out how long it takes for the population to double. So clearly we need to figure out what the exact growth decay equation for this problem is. So let's just do that. And we know that the growth decay equation can be written down as PT equals C E K T, where C and K are constants, which we need to figure out. So let's go through an example. So what the only information we have right now is that the number of bacteria increased sixfold in 10 hours. So let's try to use that. And how we write that down in terms of mathematical equations is that we, we can compare the population of bacteria at time 0 and the population of bacteria at time 10. So here, time is going to be in the unit of hours. So we know that 6 of P0 equals to P10. This is what it means to say that the population of bacteria increased sixfold. So let's just plug in what we know PT to be. So in this case, um, P of 0 is just going to be C times E of 0. So that's just going to be 6 times C on the left-hand side. And on the right-hand side, this is going to be C, E, K times 10. And we have this equation that we can work with. And the immediate thing is that we can just cancel off the Cs. Now there is something to think about is whether the c is equal to zero or not, but you can pretty easily see that if c is equal to zero, the problem becomes pretty meaningless, so we don't have to worry about that. So we can just cancel out the c's. And we have just c equals e times k times 10. So let's take the log of both sides. On the left hand side, we will get log of 6. On the right hand side, we will have log of e times k times 10. And how log works is that the log of the exponential is an inverse, obviously. So we just are left with log of 6 equals k times 10. All right? And solving for k, we get k equals 1 over 10 times log 6. So that's great. We already have one of the constants. So let's write down our equation for P given this new information that we have. So we have now that PT is equal to C times E raised to the power of 1 tenth times log 6, that's what K was, times T. Okay, And um, one way to rewrite this is we can separate out the log. And the reason we want to do this is that like exponentials and logs are inverse. So we want to write e raised to the power of log 6, and this raised to the power of 110t. So what we have now is c times 6 110t. And this is our new expression for the population. All right, so the question asks, if you may recall, um, how long did it take for the population to double? So we only have one constant, but it turns out that it's not that important to have the other constant. So you need the population to double. So we need to see um, how to get from double of what P0 was. So using this information, we have P0 is equal to C, obviously. And the question that we're asking is, when is PT equal to 2c. Let's try to answer that question. So that's, that will give us when the t, well, what t is correct so that the population doubles. So when is pt equal to 2c? And we can write down our expression for pt that we had over here. So the question is for what t is c6 1 over 10t equal to 2c? We can cancel c's on both sides. Again, we are assuming that c is non-zero, but that's not too bad to assume. We can just do that. And
then we have t in the exponential of 6 here. So the thing to do is that we have to take logs of both sides again. Log of 6, 1 times 1 over 10 t equals to log 2. And remember, in when we take logs, we can move the exponential to the bottom. We have 1 times 10 t log 6 equals log 2. But from here, it's pretty easy to obtain that t is equal to log 2 over log 6 times 10. And you can plug this in your calculator and see that this is equal to 3.87-ish. And our unit of time, as you may recall, is hours. So our guess is that the population doubles in 3.87 hours. So whenever you do a word problem like this, it's important to go back and think about whether your answer makes sense. So we have 3.87 hours. And the question is that if the population of bacteria increased by six times in 10 hours, and we are saying that it takes 3.87 hours for it to double. And just looking at that, it does seem to make sense that that would be a reasonable answer. So we conclude that yes, that our answer is 3.87 hours.